Konnichiwa and welcome back my loyals. Today we're going to talk about really quickly two of my favorite films that have been brought down and dropped down by one of my most loyals. It's called of all things the Death Tube. And uh, I will show you clips from the movie but with all the strikes I get for copyright infringement or too much improper share as it was saying goes not knowing the full line of what's fair use this is as much as I can give you on that. Death Tube is a highly underrated not doing well known horror film however it is very riveting very suspenseful and of course since it's a Japanese film it is also very little nutty but for those that are into a proper balance of gore and horror 2010's Death 2 Part 1 as well as Part 2 both released in the same year is worth the watch if you're into anything of the proper matters of foreign films you should definitely check it out now this was recommended by one of my most loyal subscribers has been with me since the beginning. Now I trip out the things that come down in DMs from him, but they are always well good suggestions. But this one I got it the other night. I checked out the film. I power watched both of them back to back, and I gotta tell you, they don't bore you, but they do make you think. So it's like say if YouTube ever flipped out. And when some matters of snuff films, well, that's where we're going to end up. So, Death Tube is a definitely inter intertwined film with a lot of different twists and turns. You pay attention to it, you'd have a good time. Of course, your thing, you should definitely check it out. And if it's not your thing, for those of you that are having lacks in content, please don't emulate the things you see in this film. But by all means, give it a look, see. You can stream it and check it out in other places. This is when I'm in video stores anymore. You can find the right place to find Death Tube. You can find it. Until next time, guys, this has been me telling you about a very good and twisted horror film. Japanese made, crazy, filled with a lot of good actors you haven't seen in other films. I have because I watch a lot of foreign films myself. But if you want to get, really get into something that's going, get out a tub of popcorn. And a couple of friends check out Dev 2. Highly recommend it. It's really good. It's really twisted. It's really crazy. But one thing it is definitely not is not the usual film you expect it to be. So until next time, to my loyals, peace out. Miss ya. Be back.